This video is going to show you some ways to quickly look at just the unread posts in your discussion board in D2L 10.3. Here's a sample discussion board in a course in which I'm an instructor. Looking specifically at this discussion board topic, the first thing I would normally do is just click on the topic title to go to a list of all the threads in the topic. From this list, I can tell which threads are new and which threads I've seen before by noticing this heavy blue bar here on the left-hand side of this particular post. This bar tells me that this post is new or that there are comments or replies that I haven't yet seen. These are another example of some posts with either that are either a new thread or have new replies. Notice that if I turn on this unread filter by clicking the unread link, then I'm only seeing threads that have that blue bar, which means these are the unread threads. If I click on a specific thread, the same blue bar rule applies. Going back to the topic, I can also use this show menu to reorder the threads or the posts by all of the categories here, most recent activity, least recent activity, author, first name, subject, etc. I can also use this search bar at the top of the screen to bring up messages by a specific person or on a specific topic. So looking at the blue unread sidebar and using the sort by and search boxes are one way to tell at a glance which posts are new and which are not. There's also a way to jump specifically to just the new threads and replies. To do that, you wanna look for the unread links on either the forum or the topic page. The very first example of unread links I'll show you is on the first overall discussions page. I'm going to get there by using this breadcrumb chain here in the upper left hand corner and clicking on discussions list. On this screen, I'm going to encourage you not just to click on the name of the topic, but to look specifically in these threads, post, and last post columns. These columns show you not only how many threads are in each topic, but how many individual posts there are and how many of these posts are new or ones that you haven't seen before. This number here in parentheses means that there are three new individual posts on this topic. And because this number is a link, notice that an underline appears when I hover my mouse over it, I can click on this link to go directly to those new posts. Now, as you can see, I've gone directly to the unread filtered view of this discussion board topic. Now I can see that there are two threads that have information I haven't yet seen. And here again, I have unread links, which will take me directly to the posts that I haven't seen. Finally, there's one other way to get to new posts in the discussion board, and that's by looking for notifications up here in the mini nav bar, either in the update alerts area, which is right here, or the subscription alerts area. By default, when you create a new thread in the discussion board, you are automatically subscribed to it. And once you're subscribed to a thread, anytime someone replies to that thread, you'll see a little red dot pop up right here in the subscriptions menu. When you click on the menu, it brings up a little pop-up list of new posts. And if you click on one of these posts in this list, it will take you directly to the reply listed and you won't have to sift through all the discussion messages or use the unread filter. So in conclusion, there are at least four different ways you can tell whether or not you have read discussion board posts and ways you can navigate directly to unread posts. First, you can use the presence or absence of the dark blue unread sidebar to tell you that a specific post or thread is unread. Second, you can use the unread filters to bring up a list of only unread threads or replies within a thread. Third, you can use the unread links both on the main topic page here, this is an example of an unread link, or within the topic page itself. Finally, you can view new posts from the alert menu in the upper right hand corner of the mini nav bar. These links here will take you directly to the specific post or reply that it lists rather than having to sift through all the discussion things. A few other navigation tricks I want to point out while you're going through discussion boards. One is these little arrows here in the right hand corner. Taking these arrows will click you to the next thread in a topic and you can go forward and backward. I also want to point out this breadcrumb chain because from this list, I can see that here I'm on a specific thread. I can go back one level to the topic level by clicking view topic, or I can go back two levels to the main discussion list page by clicking on the discussion lists link. Finally, I can use this little navigation area on the left hand side to navigate either back to the forum or to go to a specific topic within that forum.